This video will cover the topic, Rationalizing a Denominator Using Conjugates, Integer Numerator. What are conjugates? A conjugate is a binomial formed by negating the second term of the binomial. For example, say we're given the expression 4 square root 2 minus 1. The conjugate of this binomial would be 4 square root 2 plus 1. Okay, that makes sense, but how do conjugates help us rationalize denominators? To rationalize a denominator is to write an equivalent fraction without radicals in the denominator. Say we have the fraction 5 over 4 square root 2 minus 1. We can rationalize our denominator by multiplying both the numerator and denominator by the conjugate of the denominator. Earlier, we determined that the conjugate of the binomial 4 square root 2 minus 1 is 4 square root 2 plus 1. Knowing this, we can multiply the expression by 4 square root 2 plus 1 over 4 square root 2 plus 1. We can distribute the numerator and multiply the two denominators together, and when we simplify, we obtain a final result of 20 square root 2 plus 5 over 31. I think that's starting to make sense. Can we try another example? Let's rationalize the denominator and simplify the expression 3 over 5 plus 2 square root 3. Okay, so the conjugate of the denominator is 5 minus 2 square root of 3. This means we need to multiply the expression by 5 minus 2 square root of 3 over 5 minus 2 square root of 3. Exactly. When we do this, we can distribute the numerator and multiply the denominators. Once we've simplified our expression, we see that our final answer is 15 minus 6 square root 3 over 13. Okay, so to find the conjugate of a binomial, we need to negate the second term of the binomial. From here, if we are given a rational expression, we can use the conjugate of the denominator to rationalize it. That's exactly right. Great work! 